Hi, this is Curtis with UNITA. I uh, wanted to give everybody a little bit of uh, education on how to store your paper wide belts. Um, I'm actually going to show you some pictures that I recently took at a customer's place. And what you have here is a paper uh, wide belt, and as you can see, they have it sitting on the floor. Um, that's a, not a good way at all to store a wide belt, especially a paper one, because what happens is this paper basically acts like a sponge. So what's going on here is this end of the wide belt is just sucking up water, just like a sponge would. It's going to definitely uh, absorb more water than this end of the belt will. So what will happen is you put that belt on the machine. A lot of times this side has swollen and it makes it difficult for the belt to trap to uh, track. So the next best solution is to hang your belts as such. Now, as you'll see on this one, you've got these um, basically three or four inch PVC pipes that they built a uh, hanging rack out of. And um, that's a much better situation. It gets the belts off the floor, like this one is still on the floor absorbing water. And this will definitely help your belts track better if you hang them this way before you put them on the machine. Now you can even improve this process one step more. As you'll notice down here, this wide belt is rubbing this one. That's another big problem with wide belts. You do not want grain rubbing against grain because what will happen is you're likely to fracture some of that grain and then you'll end up getting raised lines when you run the belt because some of the grain has been broken off. So the absolute most perfect way to store your wide belts is to hang them on a rack built out of PVC, three or four inch PVC. And what's really good about this is these typically are about the size of your idler rollers. And then for the very best way to store them is to go get some PVC, just cut some PVC pipe, three or four inch, the same width as your wide belts and simply lay them inside the wide belts. It does not hurt the wide belts at all. And it has a lot of benefits. For instance, as you can see now, the grain on this belt is not touching the grain on that belt. And that's a great improvement. In addition, these were very freshly put in. But as the day goes on, these belts are really going to straighten out and conform to that uh, PVC pipe so that when you do pull the belt to put it on the machine, it slides in real easy. So anyway, I hope that's helpful. And if you ever need help, don't hesitate to reach out to Unita at unita.com and we're always there to help. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.